Welcome back, we're back, we're back, we're back, Yes. This is the, that was the first and the most heinous four guests Woo! in the new building. Yeah. Welcome back, season 19. 19. 19 whole seasons. What are you going to name this one, Dan? <laughs> okay, if I name it the opposite, right? I, it's like that. I just have to, oh, damn, this is called the month I didn't win. Wink. You know what I mean? Yeah, we all know. So, this is a new season of Poor Guesses. This is not the Poor Guesses set, but this is the set we currently have for all of our It's content. what we have, lights and mics <laughs> on the walls and in front of us. We're in the middle of moving. So, thank you for joining us today. Please leave a like and a comment and a subscribe down below. Professional YouTuber. Holy Literally. smokes. It, it's been so long. Yeah. I, you know what we have to guess? Uh, proof. Yep. Type. Oh, finish and bottle. Nailed it. Wow, that is completely un legible. I'm gonna that need square, you to, I'm gonna need square you to really root of what? Hit a zoom on that. It's the square root of what? That's that is a different square language. root of omen. What in the world is that word? We do have a new rule because we have a new glass. So the winner Oh no. Poor guesses champion oh, is what no. it says. What's up? Oh, yeah. What am I doing? Oh, you need a spoon. Oh, buddy, that's a lot. Let me just get those out of here. So that is a Malort Jello shot made by my wife. Okay, let it be known real quick. I okay, do also me... have to get a tattoo. Oh. That is being planned. I have found a tattoo artist. I have reached so out. that is a beef gelatin oh, powder. Dude, we're not supposed to use that. It is a thickening agent. It oh. is paleo and keto friendly. This is, hey, That's, thank God. you're on your diet, buddy. I'm I helping you out. Today, so I'm definitely not. Okay, so here's what I didn't tell you is I opened it, right? This is my punishment from last right? month. And there's a little liquid on top. Oh, oh, smell oh, the, oh, smell the liquid on top. Dude, for real, there needs to be something that so I can vomit that in. That is pure alcohol on top. So I think all the Malort flavor stayed in the gelatin and the alcohol went away. It's separate. This is a separate consistency. You sure we, you don't want we, a spoon? We just made this with what we had. True. Which was Malort and apparently beef freaking gelatin. I don't think that beef gelatin's the normal. Dude, I was going to be a good sport and try to eat as much as I could. Now that I know that there's beef stock in it, basically, as far No. I'm so scared right now. That, that? that was a tentative one there. Oh. Oh. Oh, dude. It's juicy. Oh. I don't. Okay. Go ahead. One, two, <laughs> three. I think it's good. That's a real gag. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh god oh. look that way when you're coughing fuck you got malort gelatin on the table here <laughs> oh my god oh he's gonna blow <laughs> how you doing dan i know but once that hits your tongue in the back of your throat <laughs> I forgot, it's you and me today. It's you and me, how are you doing, you beautiful, sexy, great person? I hope you're having a beautiful week. I hope it was a fantastic week. I hope next week's gonna be even better, which is great. I do, all right, three minutes on the clock, let's get it. Okay, not starting season 19 with a strong one. Ooh, that smells funky. That smells real funky. It smells crafty, um, young. It's dark though. So we did implement uh, the winner uses this glass real quick because we didn't explain it. And now I'm going to do it during my three minutes. Sorry, Sean. Uh, the winner uses this glass so they can't see the color of the whiskey as much basically. So whoever wins uses that glass for the month. Just a little disadvantage for the winner. Basically just so I can catch up to Sean. We all know that's the truth. The viscosity on this whiskey is one of the craziest things I've ever seen in my life. Dude, I, I literally almost threw up, swear to God. Wow. Like if you mixed um, apple cider vinegar with uh, Texas whiskey, is it that smells like? Single malt or scotch. Where are we at with that? That's interesting. And I've had heartburn all day, so. Okay, crafty or American single malt, one of two. It smells like leather and youth. Oh, 
Okay. That's just to get the Lord out. Okay. Okay. It. All right. Maybe I got the wrong mindset. It tastes better than it smells. I'll give it that. I feel like I'm getting a zero points uh, today. I don't think I'm starting uh, September on a high note. That's definitely American single malt or youth, and I don't know which or can't tell. Okay, we're just gonna have to go proof. It's high proof, definitely high proof. It is def, oh shit, type is one of our things. I, it's not finished. We're gonna go no on the finish. That's a half a point already. We're already up. That has to be American single malt. It's gotta be American single malt. It's too low. My proofometer is all messed up, so I can't tell you if that's American single malt or scotch. But it's, it's got leather on it, but how much? Not being able to see it kind of sucks. Not gonna lie. You know what? Screw it. We're saying American. Oh man, it's so leather. Oh man, Sean's gonna guess bourbon and then I'm gonna get super upset because I'm gonna lose half a point right off the rip. But I'm not, we're not hedging a bet. All right, one more time in for the proof. I don't think it, old line's really dark. I'm gonna go with old line though because I know we had one behind us. We can't see the bottles all in here, so. I got a minute left and I don't like anything that I've said or done so far. So proof feet seems super middle of the road. Maybe a little over a hundred, but it's got some sweetness on it though. Is that a finish? Or is that like malt? Like a Chattanooga. Oh wait, oh shit, I have 10 seconds. All right, I'm, my time's up. I wrote 111 like it's Chattanooga, but I wrote old line like it's single malt. Time is up. Three minutes on the clock. Well, now it's 3.10, so. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. That was disgusting. That single thing all over. All right, last drink, because I'm almost out of time. Is this high-proof scotch malt, or is this American single malt? <sighs> well, we don't like any of that. Okay, um, so. So when I first smelled it. Yeah. Real rough. Craft or American single malt, which one? I thought it was either American single malt or scotch. <laughs> Oh no. Cause I said it's it tastes dark, like right? if you had, I couldn't see it. I've got a black glass. Love that. This is a great idea. So I was sitting there smelling it. I was like, it smells like you took apple cider vinegar and mix it with Texas whiskey. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. There's I got something in this house. It was really sharp on it though. It's almost like Dude, a Dude, here's the one thing. Look how viscous. It's the most viscous whiskey I've ever seen. It okay. doesn't even run. It's crazy. I, here's the thing, it could be Chattanooga. No, it's, it's definitely not. My, my, I taste black licorice right now. It's definitely that's what I taste. And vomit. It's definitely not that. So, <laughs> and vomit. And stomach acid. Um, okay. I was all over on proof. I got a little bit of heartburn. It had a little tingle. Oh, we're closer than you think. Well, I guess thing I guess high. I, I think said it's like 108. A, I think it's like 100. I said 108. Yeah, it's probably because I think it's a little bit above. Yeah. I said type American. I said 111 proof. I said American single malt. Finish. I said yes. Whoa. I hedged on that one. So here's the thing: if it was because scotch, a, it is dark. There's so some real sweetness on the back end. I was getting, so I was like, I don't know, and maybe that's why I was getting the apple cider. Well, this no, should be good. Okay, I, I said no. I, I don't have any. My entire thing is hedged. Bottle. I said scotch one whiskey siding. Oh, okay. We I had it like two line. behind us. Old line. We had an old line single malt. Remember, dark as hell though. It's like black. And like 120 proof, I think. Shit, you're right, Scott. Um, what do we got? What? Patrick Mills said Jefferson's Reserve. No way is that a Jefferson's We need to go fucking find that. Okay. Guys, this is the best poor guesses ever for real. Um, so it is in a Jefferson's bottle. Reserve bottle, but. We transferred it. It's Rua American Single Malt. Holy shit, we're not awful at this. <sighs> Okay, real quick, just to confirm, it does say, also says Patrick Mills said on the back. Yeah. And on the front, we then wrote on another sticker, Rua, American single malt, 46%, 16 months old. So Buddy, that's really only, young. what, 92 proof then? We're both so high on that. Uh, so I thought it, I thought it was high. I thought it was around 100, but I guessed. Um, what'd you say you pay? Because I only said oh. 40 bucks. Yeah. Distilled aged in bottle. 25 gallon char three American white oak. 16 months by chance? Because that would actually be the giveaway for sure. I don't see that in here. Oh, so it's a small barrel. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, that's the, well, it's American single malt and a small barrel, so that's the funk. Mm -hmm. So you're getting uh, American I and uh, whole no. Whole point today. Whole point. I have a half point. This is the saddest double of all time, but I'll take it. Half to one, it's not making the list. Plus 0. 0.5, plus 0. 0.5. First time I've been in the lead in three months. I'll take that. I'm at plus one. We'll see you guys next week, probably on the Maybe. same set, most likely. Yeah.